everyone, this is Ryan Mitchell from thetinylife.com. I wanted to show you a quick update of the trailer. You can see we flashed the whole thing with the exception of the deck portion right there. You'll see that hole. I'll go over there in a second. But we used galvanized 14 inch flashing to do the whole thing. And this main function is to prevent any pests or rodents from coming up into the the house itself, it kind of a barrier, if you will. It also is going to help with moisture issues, um, just to prevent that. And then any debris kicked up from the road, even though I left the whole decking below it. But uh, this is kind of the state right now of the house. In between, and you can't see it, but we did overlapping edges of this, and then we also caulked with a flashing adhesive that's specifically designed for this. Uh, one thing I'll note, that we used uh, galvanized flashing versus aluminum. And the reason why is that regular aluminum will actually react with treated lumber, which most of the deckings of trailers are. And I'm going to be also framing my floor joists in treated lumber. So I didn't want any reactions to be happening there. And here's a quick view. This is the opening for the, the deck so that water can pass right through if it does get in at all. And I even extended the flashing down over the edges of the, the wood so that it uh, couldn't get into the seam of the wood and I, I spray painted and sealed the edges of, of the cut wood that I did which is over here so that uh, there wouldn't be any capillary action of the water sucking in even though it is still treated lumber uh, you know ounce of prevention basically all right that's it for the tiny life thanks for watching